All right, guys. <coughs> Just minimize the game for a while. We're right at the final end of the Space Marine one, and there's a reason why I was kind of talking about most of the game I've played through and gone against different factions and whatnot, and this one is just always just so hard for me as Imperial Guard. Um, Imperial Guard have a decent time, like, sieging and moving, but the, the Space Marines are so tanky and do so much damage, they just cut through, cut through me. Like, I feel if I was the Orcs, this would be... Maybe be a little bit easier, but maybe not. Um, it's just hard to know. Uh, this is just a beast of a mission to try and get through with anyone, I think. But anyway, we're just going to resume it, and uh, we'll see if this takes us maybe, you know, a few minutes or another 30 minutes to get through. It's, it's pretty rough. <laughs> I think the last video was like three hours. Reporting for duty, sir. Yeah. Okay. I didn't realize we're out of We're out of stuff. What are you orders? Reporting for duty, sir. This is my duty to show them. Reporting for duty, sir. God damn, they just... It is my duty to serve. I just won't... Just won't let it go. Fuck, I forgot all about this. What are your orders? If such is the Emperor's will... Reporting for duty, sir. I wish there's a way to the automatically Emperor's have these guys like fill up with happen. stuff so you didn't have to do this every time. Reporting for duty, sir. Well, maybe there is. Maybe is I just haven't figured it out. Finally, you will have it. If such is the Emperor's okay. will, eager for action, sir. You called, sir. Awaiting instructions. All right. Reporting for duty, sir. Reporting for duty, sir. Aren't working. You will have our tracks. It's an honor to serve the Imperium, sir. Kind of just trying to overrun them, but you will have it. Maybe I'm going to need to build some for the glory of the Imperium, sir. Yes, sir. Maybe I'm going to need to build some defenses up here. Thank you, machine spirit, for our safe arrival. An easy matter for one of my skill. I am honored that you require my skill. Yeah, we're going to build a forward base up here just to Is have faster, faster reinforcements, I think. <sighs> this guy should be running out of money, too. Well, 
only take me a moment. This is gonna take a little bit longer than I thought. So what I think I'm gonna do is go up and move my guys up here and then start building turrets or something. I think that's what we're gonna have to do. What we're gonna have to do. Initiating construction. Is that a best you've got? Limit five. Okay, that's fine. The important thing is, is that we're gonna be able to build some pretty advanced turrets up in this area. I think that's part of the issue is the invisibility stuff. So just building it. Building a. Building some detection that's built in so that we don't have to get screwed over by. As you wish, so shall it be done. Ready to unleash eleven barrels. An easy matter for one of my skill. Initiating construction. A challenge worthy of my skill. Okay. A challenge worthy of my skill. Worthy of my ah, there they go. We are the We're personification. Our weaponry is an unyielding hammer. We are the personification. Let's do it. <sighs> While they're going after that, is let's that go up here. Now we shall see if their insolence avails them. All right, you guys are going up here. You are going up here. Is that the best you've got? You are going next to this guy. Shall I get started? You are going up here. Take that down, we should have some space to kind of get this sorted up here. Alright, you guys are gonna go over here. Here to the middle. I'm gonna go up 
here, I think. Take the spot you just cleared. I just gotta take out some of their production stuff. We're gonna go up here and we gotta get some of this detection. And you. Present and accounted for, sir. Is that the best you've got? Stormblade. Eager for action, sir. Shall I get started? Shall I get started? Reporting for duty, sir. Stormblade. Just gotta get you up. The amount of uh, units these guys just are able to field is just insane.
Alright, you guys are going down there. Okay. Just gotta finish building. I can't believe I gotta build defenses right here. That's just insane. Might as well go up and heal these guys so I don't have to build them again. One of them. That's fine. We did it, sir. You guys are going to go right back up here, just straight there. Okay. 
We almost had it. Just was not expecting it to go this long. Oof. So long. Ugh. Oh, thank you, God. Good Lord. No. We can save. The gene seed must be preserved. The attack and fuel to the Thunderhawk. Understood. Join the brother of Apothecary. We will cover your escape. And you? We cannot allow the enemy to claim our relics. This area must be cleansed with orbital fire. The chapter will honor you, brother. There is no honor to be had in defeat. But someone must deliver the targeting beacon. Orbital control. Lock onto this beacon and fire. Full power. Oh, thank God. <laughs> the clash between Governor Militant Alexander and the Blood Raven Captain Thule could only end in blood. Both had explicit orders, and both were convinced they acted with the Emperor's blessing. Only when the Liberators had driven into North Vandia and leveled the Space Marines Castellum Incorruptus did the Blood Ravens cease their purge of the planet and withdraw. Although orbital salvos from the Blood Ravens Battle Barge leveled much of the remains of the base, Governor Alexander directed his men to conduct a careful search <clears throat> for any records the Space Marines might have left behind. Their search was not in vain, and Alexander uncovered records linking the chapter to past visits to the planet, as well as disturbing contradictions in the chapter's history. It seems likely that these just Alrighty. Good. Guys, that was awful. That was just awful. Oh, that one's that's gonna be a hard a hard one to conquer too at level ten, but we might be able to do it. Oh, I don't know if I want to take on the Tau now. That just seems like another awful, like awful thing to do. So I'm going to save once. And then I'm going to end the turn and we'll just take care of any defenses we might have to do. Probably the orcs, because they always like to do that. No, they didn't do it. So yeah, I think, even though the game says we killed all the Blood Ravens, I am pretending that we're teamed up now. So we're going to make a mutual push on the Tau City to reclaim this, and then we got to purge the Orcs and the Necrons. So we're going to save. But yeah, I think... Ugh. I think we're going to I think we're gonna do a little a little break and oh, I might try I, I want I think that my my favorite you know the Space Marines Imperial Guard are my favorite I have an orc campaign going but I might do a Necron or a Space Marine campaign next and I'm not sure which one will be better uh, I'm not sure. Um, we'll do that. We'll do that in the next one. 
Um, I'll decide if I want to continue the orc one or start the the space marine and or necron one. I might do a few necron ones because they take a little bit of time and I haven't ever conquered the map with them, so we'll just have to see. I find the necrons very difficult though because I don't. I think their infantry and their vehicles are both underwhelming. I think they're actually a pretty weak race as far as everything goes. Um, maybe not in the vanilla, but definitely in the. Uh, in the campaign, they, they feel very weak. Um, they just don't have the firepower to really take out a lot. Um, also, I think their main detectors are wraiths, which, you know, have to, have to be constructed. They count as infantry cap, and it's just difficult. So, well, we'll see. We'll have to see, but until then... We'll play later, guys.